Hello friends, if you're watching this video then you're likely trying to figure out how to install Sky UI for Skyrim Special Edition. It took me a long time to figure out how to do this as I couldn't find a single video that would actually show me how. Many videos claimed to show you how to do it but didn't actually take you through step by step, which is exactly what this video is going to do. This is so easy guys, this is easier than taking candy from a diabetic that doesn't want to eat candy anymore. Just quickly before we get started, I am assuming that you have Nexus Mod Manager installed and that you know how to use it. The very first thing that you need to do is actually download the mod. I'm going to leave a link in the description below to this exact page. Once you navigate here, click the Files button and scroll down until you see version 2.2. It's extremely important that you download this file. You're going to want to download it manually. If you hit this button and download with Manager, you're going to get a pop-up saying that your Nexus Mod Manager is not set up for Skyrim. That's because it's set up for Skyrim Special Edition. Once you've downloaded the file manually, find the file and save it somewhere on your computer that you can easily access it. Navigate back to Nexus Mod Manager and click this button that you've probably never even noticed. Click Add Mod from File. You're then going to want to locate the file and hit Open. In your search bar, search for Sky UI, and there it is. Just like any other mod, hit the install button. During the installation, you'll see this window pop up, which lets you edit some of the options in the mod. Once you're finished there, hit install, and congratulations, the next time you open Skyrim, you'll have Sky UI. Something to note quickly is that when you do open your inventory, you will get this warning sign. Don't worry too much about it. Apart from the fact that it looks a bit ugly, it doesn't affect your gameplay at all. It's just warning you that this mod was developed for Skyrim, not Special Edition, and that some of the scripting for this mod is missing. But the general features of Sky UI still work. One thing that does not work is the search bar up the top here. So there you have it guys, I hope this video helped you, if it did, please help me by leaving a like. And as always guys, stay frosty.